If there's no further discussion on the underlying bill, we shall proceed with amendments in the order listed on the roster. The only amendment on the roster for this bill is offered by the gentlewoman from Ohio, Ms. Sykes. The clerk will report Sykes Amendment Number 69. Sykes Amendment Number 69, Amendment to H.R. 9197, offered by Ms. Sykes of Ohio. Without objection, the amendment is considered as read, and the gentlewoman from Ohio is recognized to explain the amendment. Thank you, Mr. Chairman, and I first want to thank my colleagues, uh, Representative Stevens and Collins, for introducing such an important bill aimed at aimed to create and identify resources to help small businesses understand and adopt AI technologies. Uh, and thank you, uh, Mr. Chair and Ranking Member Lofgren, for bringing it to the committee today. Uh, my amendment, if accepted, will enhance uh, the efforts of Representative C Stevens and Collins um, by extending the directive to include NIST Holling's Manufacturing Extension Partnership Program. Uh, the manuf Manufacturing Extension Partnership Program, or MEP, is an important program administered by NIST that is critical uh, to uh, the state of Ohio and small and medium manufacturing companies. Uh, in fact, small and, small and medium manufacturing companies represent 90% of the job growth in high paying fields in our state. MEPs across the country help manage networks of regional partners that provide training and technical assistance to the manufacturers and small businesses that are the economic engines of our state. There are six MEP uh, regional partners in Ohio to support statewide assistance in Northeast Ohio's MEP is called Magnet, or the Manufacturing Advocacy and Growth Network supporting businesses in my district, Ohio's 13th. As we are all still trying to figure out the capabilities of AI and what it means, there is real opportunity for businesses to boost efficiency and productivity using AI tools, and this amendment will help ensure that MEPs have the adequate support to provide training and services for the understanding and adoption of artificial intelligence technologies and manufacturing practices for, again, small and medium-sized businesses across the country, and particularly in Ohio's 13th, where manufacturing is so very important uh, in the Midwest and beyond. Mr. Chairman, I'm hoping we can show up for our small and medium-sized manufacturers through the expanded support of our MEPs as it pertains to AI resources, so I encourage my colleagues to support this amendment, and I yield back. The gentlelady yields back. Mr. Chairman, I want to thank Ms. Sykes for her good amendment, which highlights how crucial it will be that the country's small and medium-sized manufacturers can adopt AI tools into their processes. NIST Manufacturing Extension Partnership Program has a critical role to play in this space. I support the amendment and urge my colleagues to do the same and yield back. The gentlelady yields back. Does any other member wish to be recognized on the amendment? Hearing no others, the question is on agreeing to the Sykes Amendment, number 69. All in favor, signify by saying aye. 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 All those opposed say nay. The ayes appear to have it. The ayes appear to have it. The ayes do indeed have it. The amendment is agreed to. 